Now, aside from giving comfort to one's feet, flat or doll shoes are often perfect for every occasion. Now, an online shop boasts of a variety of these and more. Pia Bonalas tells us all about this from Las Piñas. Hi, Pia. Claire, I don't think I'm exaggerating when I say that all girls love shoes. And of course, I'm one of those girls who love them pretty shoes, but they have to be very comfortable for me to really wear it every day, especially with this job. That's why it's always such a welcome thing for me to see all these new shoe companies such as Feet Her Well, where they have very nice trendy shoes that are also very comfortable. With me as owner, Ivan Requinta to tell us more about their shoes. Good morning, Ivan. Good morning. Can you tell me first about Feed Her Well? Because from the name itself, it seems that you're putting comfort first with your products. Okay. Uh, basically, the shoes that uh, we are doing uh, is mostly uh, flats and dull shoes. And the, the, the purpose of uh, coming up with this business is basically to tell the, the, the customer or somebody telling the customer that uh, the shoes that you bought uh, really fit you well, mm -hmm. not just uh, figuratively, but and literally. So, mm -hmm. yeah, that's it. So, these are, like you said, very comfortable shoes because yeah. mga flats nga siya. Yeah. And the first few designs that you came up with are these ones with the piping and like the small ribbon. Can you tell yes. me who made the design for these first shoes that you came up with? Actually, the, this design, uh, it's a combination of me and my wife, Abigail. Uh, pero the color combination kasi is being decided of course by my wife. Mm -hmm. So pero the designs and all uh, including the the shoes that uh, we see here are all uh, designed mostly by me and my wife. Pero it's mostly me. Oh, <laughs> yeah. okay. So when did you get into ladies shoes? It's very um, unusual. Actually, uh, my wife and I are really into shoes uh, even before. Mm -hmm. um, that's why we, we also bought this uh, franchise of Mr. Quickie. Then once we bought the, the franchise, we, we directly buy the materials kasi. So syempre, after learning the, the language of shoes and all, so we decided to come up with uh, our own shoe line. Pero syempre, we also studied uh, which is more marketable. Eh, girls naman kasi, uh, they constantly change their shoes, unlike men. So we, we decided to focus more on shoes, mm -hmm. uh, specifically flats. Kasi we also noticed that uh, after work, uh, there are some girls who remove their heels after a long day of work. Yes. So they, they shift to uh, flats, uh, which they use when going home or like uh, just chilling out after office. But are these imported? Are they made locally? Yeah, uh, the materials are basically sourced from uh, Laguna, Iliu Laguna. And some are uh, sourced in Bulacan and others in uh, Marikina because we also like to promote uh, our local brand and local uh, feed items. Alright, so like we mentioned, these are the first ones you came up with and then yeah. after you launched this, what were the shoes that came right after? Actually, uh, these three were the original ones mm -hmm. along with the, with the, uh, the denim brand but uh, before it was blue. Uh -huh. So after that, we decided to launch uh, a few others like the suede, which has uh, six uh, colors. Uh, then uh, we started to release this uh, printed ones uh, to add some creative. variants. Yes. And Can then, you tell me, sorry, uh, first yes. about the suede? Because yeah. I have problems with suede shoes. Because, yeah. uh, well, of course, they look very pretty. But whenever I do wear them, I feel like it's easy Yeah, yeah. Actually, the, the problem with suede nga is uh, it's really uh, uh, easy to para madumihan siya. Mm -hmm. Pero there are some certain cleaners naman that you can buy from the market that erases those uh, mancha, kumbaga. Mm -hmm. So that's it. Uh, basically, suede really are, are used indoors and for, you, know, you, you can't wear suede during uh, rainy season. Ah, uh, yeah, because yeah. that would really just kill the shoe and yeah. if you want to retain how pretty they are. Yes, yes. At least take care of it. Okay, so after this, yung mga printed and then after the printed one, uh, This is our new release. Uh, <coughs> this one, the slip-ons. Actually, it's just one color but we will release in uh, four colors. Uh, we have black, tan, pusha pink, and mustard yellow. Then, These look really nice and yeah. because you know, madami na yung uso, like the ones that are medyo pa-loafer na yung yes. style. Yes. And so I think this is something to look forward to in the yes. 
coming months. So sorry, what other colors did you say would uh, we come up with? We also we will be releasing a uh, tan, mm -hmm. uh, fuchsia pink, and mustard yellow. Wow, so very yeah. fashionable talaga, yeah. and they would look so pretty from day to night. Pwede, yes, pwede siya. correct, correct. And then of course, summer is coming up. Yes, yeah, summer is coming up. So we we are about to release uh, this types of shoes. Uh, we will, I think, we will be releasing eight colors of this one. Uh, so it basically looks like toms. Yes. Yeah, so you can use it uh, when we're going to the beach or walking in some mall, wearing shorts and all. So it's kind of hip and trendy. Yes, they are. And the thing is, because Paris, it's crocheted, so yeah. you know, you could wear it in the beach and shampoo it. Well, sand could come in and then you could also get it wet. <laughs> yes, so yes. that's okay. Yes, yes, yes. So I'm curious about like because Shempre getting into this kind of business. You would learn all about the world of feet. Because yes. usually ako naman, yes, I do love wearing flats because they're very comfortable. But sometimes at the end of the day, I find it na parang sumasakit yung pa ako. Is there a certain <laughs> way of really like maximizing their comfort without really yung yung end of the day pagod ng pa? Yeah, uh, flats basically are intended for uh, flat flat-footed and mid-arc uh, feet. Because uh, high arc, uh, high arc feet uh, will. Do you think I have? Yeah, uh, it's it's kind of well affects it, it. It adds stress because when you when you step on something, because the the there's no cushion on mm. the the arc. Uh, so it's recommendable talaga na when you're wearing a when you're a high arc person, you you like wear something that has a cushion mm. here in the middle. So okay. that's why. Uh, siguro uh, as we go along uh, with our business, we will be releasing a sole that would cater uh, all types of feet, flat footed, mm -hmm. um, mid, mid arc, or uh, high arc. Para lang at least it wouldn't add stress, especially <laughs> sa you. <laughs> Ayan, so that's something to look forward to for me, especially yeah. since I love flats and with just a little bit of cushioning, yeah, yeah. then I could wear them comfortably all day long. Thank yeah. you so much, right. Ivan. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, for those of you who want to, you know, uh, I just want to add, you do have an advocacy. I mentioned it a while yes, ago. Yes, yes. Can you tell me a little bit about that also? Okay, so uh, part of our uh, vision as husband and wife is to also not just to promote uh, being entrepreneurs, but also to be, become philanthropists. Mm -hmm. So in our own little way, uh, it is a business now, man, once you buy a pair of shoes, uh, we really intend to give uh, a pair of shoes also to like charity, mm -hmm. orphans, see kids. So right now, since we're starting, we kind of replace that Muna with slippers. So okay. for every pair of shoes that you buy, there's a couple of slippers that we also give to, uh, to charities and foundations. So there. There you go. That's one thing I couldn't let go this morning. That's why I just yeah. really had to put that in. Thank you so okay. much, Ivan. Thank you, Pia. There you have it. For those of you who are looking for fashionable shoes and still making it for a cause, you know where to go. Feed her well.